Hey everybody, how's it going? My name is Garrett, and today we're checking out another new G Fuel flavor. We are going to taste test the Mega Potion. This actually just came out um, not too long ago. Um, mine finally arrived today. I know a lot of people got theirs yesterday of this recording. It came out on uh, the 12th. Um, I just get, you know, a day late, dollar short. But uh, I got to try out the um, XQC flavor yesterday, which was a good one. Uh, pretty decent. I think I'm going to let my buddy Cody try it out and see what he thinks of it. And then I've got one, I got five other flavors <laughs> to taste test right now. And you can kind of see what's coming up here. Uh, but we're going to do Mega Potion today. Pretty cool looking artwork um, in collaboration with Capcom and Monster Hunter. Uh, not a big Monster Hunter fan personally, but, um, you know, I'm going to respect it. Supposedly this is going to be mango and jackfruit. Now, I've never tried jackfruit, so I'm kind of interested uh, on this. So, let's uh, do what we do, and let's cut her open. We always keep our top on, because we're not born in a barn. I'm excited. I'm really kind of excited. Uh, the XQC was okay. Uh, it wasn't bad. If you haven't go seen that video, go look at that one. Powder is a little pinkish. Woo! You definitely get uh, fruity. Mmm. That mango comes through very good. I'm guessing that other smell might be the jackfruit. Uh, that's a good question. Hmm. But reading online, actually, I guess it's illegal to import jackfruit to the United States or something like that. I don't, like, you can't grow them here. Just those interesting little... Things about imports and stuff like that. Uh, but yeah, this uh, looks good already. I'm excited. See how it goes. Got about, eh, 80% scoop. Close to 90. My scoop was right on the top this time. Always makes me curious on how that scoop gets stuff in there, plus end up in the middle. Magic. Oh, I like that powdered smell. There's very few powders that I'm like, wow. Uh, but this one's really nice. And again, uh, the artwork on here is beautiful. 100% Monster Hunter theme uh, from the new game Rise. Beautiful looking. Let's see what the uh, powder itself looks like. Ooh, it's got kind of a mango color. Wow, that is really yellow. Yellow orange. It's definitely a, uh, you can tell this is mango. Wow, that is potent. I can smell it from here. Kind of looks like a... That looks like a orange juice or like a, a Sunny Bee kind of color. Get tightened up here, as always, in the uh, Code Vein Shaker. Very much like um, a Sunny D color. Very, um, very bright. Very, very orange yellow. All right. So, as always, I'm going to give it a good shake and see you in a moment. Okay, we're back. Give it a good shake. Let's give it a pop. Wow, that's a pop. Okay, smell. Ooh, that mango. That is mango. And I'm guessing that other smell is the jackfruit. That mango cuts through beautifully. Jackfruit, I'm guessing, again, I, I'm guessing that's what that smell is. Yeah, all right. Well, let's give it a go. As always, to your health. Hmm. Not a big fan. Not a big fan. Um, the mango really kind of goes away. It's there. But I'm guessing the flavor that we're getting is jackfruit. Um, it's okay. It's got a little citrus, but it's kind of... I'm trying to think of what, the, what to call that flavor. It's kind of dull. It's got a dull flavor to it. Um, it's not, it's got a sweetness from the mango, but then you're followed up by this dullness and then the dullness just kind of lingers. Hmm. It, it, different aftertaste as well. Um, the, the mango is gone at this point. I really don't get much mango left. 
and the dullness still is there. Hmm. I'm trying to think on what, um, I mean, it's not bad. It, it's really not horrible. <laughs> I'm trying to be as uh, descriptive though. You, you do get mango, but it really takes the back seat. When you, when you smell it, you get this pungent mango. Like that is the first thing that hits your, hits your nose, your receptors is that mango. But you don't get much of it here. You get kind of a dull and a little bit of sweet. Um, it, it really doesn't do a lot else for it. Um, definitely not going to be a go-to for me. It's not bad, uh, but uh, I've got so many other flavors that I don't think I'm going to go back to this one. Maybe if I crack some ice over it, um, that might change it up a bit, chill it down. I know some people do mix of flavors, but I have to say that uh, it's kind of disappointing. I'm not a huge fan of it. Maybe it's maybe I'm not a fan of jackfruit. That's a possibility. <laughs> um, hmm. I, I really don't know what else to say besides uh, it's okay. I'm interested to try the guava. I got a, a tub of the guava back here, and I'm interested to see if that flavor profile will be a good one to mix with. I might have to come back to this one and mix it up with some guava if I feel like that might be a good mix. But the, the yeah, the mango's there, but that not much else. But yeah, I think that's where I'm going to wrap it up. It's an okay flavor. It's going to be forgettable to me. Uh, just being honest, it's okay. But I want to hear what you guys think. Are you interested to pick yourself up some Mega Potion? Um, it's back ordered right now to like mid-April, end of April. Um, personally, I would hold off on this. Maybe wait to a BOGO. Maybe, maybe not. That's up to you. But yeah, let me know in the comment section what you thought of Mega Potion. Did you like it? Did you love it? Did you think it was okay? Did you hate it? So yeah, until next time, you guys, stay frosty.